I am excited because this is the day before tomorrow. The day before tomorrow. Tomorrow, as you guys know, I'm going to be making a run for my pro card um, in Classic Physique and the uh, MPC. I'm going to be going to Vegas for Olympia weekend. I believe show day is September 13th. Now, I'm really excited about this because I've wanted to be uh, a pro athlete for my whole entire life, my whole entire life. And I think one of the big key natures about being a pro athlete that people need to understand is that there's so much work that goes in behind the scenes. You know, as a kid, I would always go and watch basketball. My dad was a pro athlete in basketball, football, and you see these different sports and you sort of get this idea, this concept of like, what is it like to be in the shoes of these athletes? What I think people don't really understand is kind of behind the scenes, behind, you know, the lives of these people, what kind of devotion, dedication, energy, commitment does it actually take to be in a position where you set yourself up to be at the peak of your level and to be able to execute. So to be able to do that, I have a team of a few people. I have my gentleman who's holding the camera right now who is going to be documenting uh, this, this, this story, sort of not just what is their training system like and what sort of goes on in the life of an athlete going after it, but also, you know, my, 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 my you know, specialists who help me recover and make sure that my body's in a position where every day I can sit there and, and break it down. There are specialists who are responsible for, you know, energizing my body and feeding my body nutrition, but also breaking that down. What are my relationships like with these people? Who's my support team that I put in to be able to make sure that I'm held accountable emotionally, psychologically, physically, that I get my butt out of bed? All of that stuff is important. So we're here at the Mecca. We're here at the Mecca right now, kind of showing you guys a panorama. This is uh, just a little bit of an area in where the sweat equity will be paid. Uh, we're here at Rocky Mountain Flex Fitness. If you guys have not had the opportunity to come down and see us in downtown Denver, we are uh, just short of the Arts District. When I go to put myself in bodybuilding shape, it becomes a different psyche as a focus. And in order to be able to do that, I have to make sure that uh, I, I'm, I'm an engineer from the ground up. And the ground up is really about the dedication that starts here from the mindset. Yeah, it is you know the, the lifting and the nutrition, the supplements and and, and the workout partners and all the time and the cardio, I mean, all that stuff, all that stuff is great. But the reality, the reality is that you have to be in a position where you are building your mind simultaneously. If you're in a position where you do that, you're gonna crush. You're gonna do well because you're gonna learn to be resilient. You know, I think so many people think that they can sit here and just set an archetype and a structure. And yes, you do have to do that. And yes, you should try to stick with that. But at the end of the day, if you don't, you know, th if that's not there, if you don't have that internal desire to sit there and just crush and go after it, then, you know, you're going you're, you're gonna to screw. So I'm going to show what is it like to fully devote yourself to a cause. What is it like when you want something really bad? Do you know why you want it? Do you know exactly what it is you're going after? How do you prime yourself each and every day put yourself in a winning position that's gonna set you apart and it's just gonna be that gradual 2% or 3% or 5% every day that you're gonna end up doing. And it's exciting to be able to show this because transformation is a full process inside and out. You know, I'm hoping and I'm, I'm looking forward to growing emotionally and psychologically, physically, but physically I know exactly what my body's capable of. I'm gonna be working with seven people, a seven person team. Uh, to really kind of help cultivate this whole thing. And again, like I said, that's going to come down to the nutritionist. We'll be working with Rick from Fit Foods. Um, he's going to also be providing the food as well as the meal plan and uh, giving me some advice and supplementation. How do those supplements change over the duration of these next 12 weeks? What ends up happening when um, I work with my coach, uh, who, my, my, my training coach, who's going to sit there and basically take a look at my body and say, this is what we need to do. We need more here and more or less here. And we start to put that down. Uh, my lifting partners, I have four of them, um, who come in and push me at different times and push each other and, and just go all in. 
I have uh, recovery specialists, people help make sure that I'm massaged, the tissue's right, that my, my body is opening up, that I'm doing my flexibility, they hold me accountable to that. You know, all these people play such a vital role in making sure that every day I can come in here to the best of my ability and do that. And so, I'm stoked. I want to document this primarily to show you behind the scenes what is it like to fully and wholeheartedly devote yourself to a cause. What is it like when you want that thing? What is it like when you're putting a plan together? What goes on behind the scenes? How do you learn resiliency? When stuff doesn't go the way that you want it to, how are you still gonna wake up every day and get your butt on the platform and do the sweat equity so that way you can make sure on day of you say you did everything in your power and when life got hard, you still found a way. That's really what this is all about. So I cannot wait. I would love to hear from you. Questions, comments, your support is gonna be more than ever. If it's just a like, if it's just you know a comment and keeping it up, believe me, that extends so much further than I could actually possibly voice. If you have questions about something you yourself are doing or things that you might wanna be doing, just go after it. Like my thing is just go after it, but before you go after it, do be strategic in your planning. Put people around you that are not only going to help assist you, but are gonna hold you accountable and they're not gonna let you slack off. And the third thing is go all in. Go all in financially, do what you have to do to budget yourself. Set yourself up timeline wise. Set all distractions out to the side, don't even have them in your life. Going all in means all in. And if it's something that's gonna be uncomfortable, it's gonna push you, it's gonna make you better, Go and do that stuff. I can't wait to show you guys exactly what that looks like in my life, and I'm, I'm stoked. I'm stoked about it. So you're gonna be seeing some more footage here. Welcome to my vlog.